What? What? Right I got a freaking coral banded shrimp. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? This is the most crazy tide pool video I've ever seen. I mean, we are pocket to pocket. There is something in almost every pocket. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah. Oh, that's so going in my tank. That is so going in my tank. Look at us right now. We're on the edge. We are on the edge. We are here, back home in the fish building with What is going on, fellas? Welcome back to another video. We are here at Coral Cove, one of my favorite spots in the beautiful Jupiter, Florida. You know, this place is just stunning. And just like St. Thomas, when we made a video tide pool hunting, we found so many different things in St. Thomas. Jupiter, Florida has a couple tide pools here at this beautiful beach called Coral Cove. And that's all them right there. All those rocks hold water when the tide comes up or waves crash up, which then holds fish and invertebrates and stuff like that, that we're gonna find today. So, Brent <laughs> Brenton has got the net. We got a GoPro. I'm not sure what's going on here. I'm just gonna throw him over. Nope. And let's get to action. Brenton, you good? You ready to start filming? I'm, I'm ready to start catching. Oh, you already start? No, not yet. We gotta get to the tide pools over there. Oh. Sometimes that kid just, it makes me wonder how the heck he's got 19 years into life. <laughs> I can't even walk straight right now. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I wish I came on a higher tide. We still got some pockets of water, but not as much as when it's fully high. We're gonna keep walking. We got some pockets of water over here. A little bit deeper on the edge is the waves can crash over. When it's high tide, all this is actually covered when it's high. So we're at a perfect tide. The water's dropped down. Time to see if we can find some stuff. Show us water. Look. All those little pools of water. Everything just gets stuck. As you can see. Oh. Snail? A snail. Oh, it's a hermit crab. Oh, snail. Yeah, if you look real closely, there are little hermit crabs. A little tiny hermit crab inside there. That's their first find right there. A hermit crab. Can you see him up in there? You can actually. You can see him? Or just a little bit. He's got his little, his little feet are out. Oh my goodness. I gotta go down there. What? <gasps> right there. Right. What? Right there. Coral banded shrimp. No. A coral banded shrimp. Look, 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 he's tucked in this hole. Let me see no the camera. No way! The first hole we looked in. Look, 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 wait. Whoa. See him? And there's a hermit crab right there. Let me obtain Look at the GoPro hermit crab. Shot. Look at that. Another hermit crab, dude, the same exact kind. A couple little things away. Holy sh dude. A coral banded shrimp. As you can see, oh, there's another snail right here. This is obviously a snail, as you can see, and the others were hermit crabs. But this guy I'm gonna leave up here. Cause these guys love to just walk the rocks. All right, I gotta get this thing. I have a net, but this net, I don't think, the net won't fit inside this hole. There's only a couple, a couple parts. So it's time, oh my gosh, is there anything else? How do I get him without him pinching me? Dude, wow. That is a beautiful, beautiful shrimp. Hey, buddy. Hey, look at that. How pretty does it get? A coral banded shrimp. These giant little feelers they got, and their colors are so pretty. Oh, it's all come here, come here. Uh, here. Oh. What do you have? I got a coral banded No, look, 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 look. A baby pulls at this! It's a baby scot! It's a baby scot! I got a freaking coral banded shrimp! Oh! I gotta put him in the window. Oh! Dude, I'm getting so, so, so. Alright, we have found two things very rapidly, quickly. Um, this is literally one of the only things of rock that has got enough water in it to house anything. We found hermit crabs, snails, uh, coral banded shrimp, and now Brenton just found a baby. Uh, the smallest little puffer fish I have <laughs> ever seen, dude. Yeah! <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. That thing is so tiny. Look how tiny. You almost could not even see it. That would be the cutest little thing for a tank. Can you see him? Yeah. Oh my, look at this little fin moving. He's adorable. That might be the cutest thing I've ever seen. We have a coral banded shrimp and a baby puffer fish right here. I'm gonna try to get them both up into a tide pool, maybe a little bit higher. Ow, ow, ow. Right. My goodness. Oh. Whoa, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Did you see that? Bro! Oh my goodness. Did you not notice that the whole time you were I over here? I did not notice that at all. Look at that. There's a fish. There's a fish There's right a there. Fish. Another one. Yes. 
What? This is, I can't, I can't, give me a break. This is the most crazy tide pool video I've ever seen. I mean, we are pocket to pocket, there is something in almost every pocket. Snails, hermit crabs, shrimp, puffer fish, a, a grunt, a literal grunt. A grunt? Yes. Dude, there's more hermit crabs. Look at this. There's another hermit crab right there. Look at it, he's coming out, he's coming out right now. That's another hermit crab, we'll add that one. Okay, this can be really, oh, oh my gosh. He is absolutely terrified. He's so fired up. Oh, you're done. You're done for now. These fish, oh, he's stuck in a hole. Look, he's trying to get in the hole. <laughs> These fish are crazy cool, and they litter the beaches here. They swim along with the pods of croakers and whiting that are all along the beach. And as you can see, this guy got into a little tide pool here, and they got a big old mouth. You see that mouth? They feed on all crustaceans, shrimp. You name it, they eat it pretty much. This is like a little, I don't know if you could hear it on camera, but they, they call them grunts because they go, that's what they do, literally. This tide pool, he probably won't live long just because it does get hot throughout the day. So wait till another wave comes. See ya, buddy. He's gonna go live a happy life out in the ocean. There's another hermit crab. This is the most crazy tide pool video ever. Come over here, let's check out. Look at the baby puffer swimming away. Do you need to figure out what the heck? We didn't bring a bucket, did we? He's gonna get real big. He's gonna get real big, and I don't really have somewhere for a puffer fish, um, unfortunately. Although that, look at this thing. Look at him, look how cute. Look how cute he is. His little fins moving back and forth. That might be single-handedly the most adorable thing. Look at him, he's quick too. I've ever seen in my life. I don't know how Brenton caught that. See the water just splash up into here? See that? Yep. That's literally what keeps these things alive throughout the day until the tide rises. Oh my goodness. It's the cutest thing ever. It's the cutest thing ever. You're releasing him, there he goes. See you later, buddy. He's gone. <laughs> He's gone. He's gone. That's so sad. I know, into the ocean he goes, where he first was. Oh, goodness. I miss him already. I'm gonna cry. Okay, I just went and got a bucket and put some water in it so we can take stuff home. Brenton has got the bucket for us. Okay. Do you wanna put it in there? That is one beautiful shrimp right there. There he goes. See ya, buddy. And now I put, of course, the other hermit crab as well. You gotta release him because those guys will eat fish. Good pharaohs, if you guys want to see more Tide Pool videos like this, smash the like button. It is Vlogmas, we're posting almost every single day, so Monday through Friday. Make sure to subscribe, don't miss these videos. But seriously, smash the like button if you guys want to see more Tide Pool videos. There's more water over here, like up there and back over there. There's also pockets oh, there yeah. and there. Look at these pockets, look at that. Oh, my goodness. Walking through rocks. Here. Oh my. There's oh, something in there. Oh, There's got, something yep, in there. Yep, 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 yep. What's in there? What's yep. in there? A, a crab. Wait. A crab. What are you looking for? Right I was there. looking at something else. Nope. Look. Look, look, look. Son of a gun. Oh, there's a hole. He's got a hole in there. I wish I had a smaller net. My net won't go in there. There's a crab in there. Go around on that side. There was something on that side too in the back left. Yeah. Oh my god, dude. What was See, that? I'm not doing that. What was that? This is a giant hole in the rock. <laughs> that was a little mangrove crab inside that hole. Let's keep working our way up. Look at the size of that oh one. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Head that way. Look at this Head size. north. Look at the size of that North. One. Look at this tide pool. Look at these. It's literally holes. My goodness. Some seaweed. Nothing. My feet hurt so bad. Oh. No. Stay. Stop. Stop. Arrow crab. What? Arrow crab. Oh. He's looking right at us. Look at him. He's looking right at us, dude. And he's blending into that, that algae. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's so going in my tank. That is so going in my tank. Look at that arrow crab. That is another invertebrate that we get a lot here. You've seen them snorkeling. That is an arrow crab, and they get that name because they got that long-headed arrow right there. Oh, my God. This is so much fun, dude. I'm uh, I'm currently, oh, I'm doing like a yoga pose on this. I gotta keep him in here. I'm gonna keep him right there in the net. We're on a the crab, edge. A crab, a crab. Oh, 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 it's dead. Oh, RIP. RIP. It's dead. RIP that mama. That's a baby stone crab. It's already dead. Look at us right now. We're on the edge. We are on the edge of a giant cliff. It's not that giant, but it's big. Ah, ah. Oh. Look at him, look at him crawling. Crawling like a spider. Ah, ah. I hate spiders. Ready? Go in there, buddy. We got a couple more rocks to check. Let's keep moving. It is crazy to see some of the structures that these rocks have made. Hey, Brenton! Oh, there was a <laughs> lot of water! <laughs> That's crazy, all this. Oh, a fish! A fish! Oh, a fish! Gobi. You see him? Yep, 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 yep. Oh, 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 get him? Nope. 
Those little guys are so hard to catch. My goodness, take a look at this. That is crazy, Caparos. That is it for the rocks and tide pools for today. Every single day, more and more water comes in, tides go up and down, and new invertebrates and fish get washed into these tide pools. So if you do want to see more, I'm telling you, just smash the like button, let me know. We just checked this entire bank of tide pools and found all sorts of beautiful creatures. Creepy crawlers, fish, we even found a, literally a grunt. That was the craziest find of the day. Because surprisingly enough, a lot of times the fish get out of these tide pools. But you'll find everything inside these tide pools. So you guys see the name of the place, it's called Coral Cove. If you're ever in town from a different state or whatever and you come into Florida, come check these tide pools. It's really, really fun. Just be very, very careful on these rocks because they are sharp, pointy, and will break. Sheesh. Sheesh. Tide pool hunting, it was so much fun. I, I could do that all day long. Literally, I wish we had more rock. We had no more rock pools to literally explore. Yeah, there's just like one little stretch. A little stretch of rock. That was awesome though. We actually got the job done. As you can tell, we got a coral banded shrimp and a arrow crab in here. We're gonna take those home to the tank. New, we got new invertebrates. New fish and we put other fish back into the ocean. We did, saved a couple, which we didn't technically save because they do this on their own, but. All right, well, I will see you Back at home with our goodies. A Kuda Matata. Uh, it's a turtle dairy. Let's go to the beach, beach. Let's get away. Ends up and touch the sky. We are here, back home in the fish building with our scrimps and a crab. This is the tank it's going into. We have a little tiny snowflake eel right down there. And I actually am going to name this eel because I told you guys to comment in one of my most recent videos when we got the eel. There was thousands of comments. I ended up picking actually a comment from one of our PC members. If you're not a member, exclusive videos, live streams, yada, yada, yada. Links are down below. Don't miss out on that. Become a PC member. One of our members named it. And we're gonna name the eel Olaf. You know? Olaf. I gotta, Olaf. I kinda like it. It's kinda fire. How do you feel about Olaf? What are we naming Olaf? The eel. The eel, the snowflake eel. Snowflake eel. Oh, period. Oh. Period. Period. I guess so, yeah, period. On, on Mary. On Mary, with her lambs. <laughs> Check this. Check this out, yo. Bam. Oh, oh, oh yeah. That boy walking. Yes. Oh, yeah. He's like a spider. I really hope the fish don't mess with him. Well, we did find it, so I didn't spend money. That's, uh, that's on the yeah. bright side, you know? If anything, you're rescuing him. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that beautiful coral banded shrimp. And I might actually end up moving these into the big aquarium inside eventually. He's in the back behind the rock. That right there is two new shrimp. Well, one's an arrow crab, one's a coral banded shrimp. Everything in the fish building is eating and happy. I've got the fly river which is looking so much better. Look at his back. Oh, can, I, can you see it? Look at that, it's almost all gone. It's almost all gone. He's got his own tank now, bare bottom. Um, might do a couple of other things, but this is his own. I just gotta get a light for it. Arowana, of course, from the last video, we got a Garami. There's the royal clown showing himself for once. Garami is hiding now, so you gotta switch spots, huh? Mantis is literally in the tank eating a silver side right now. And we have received the paint, the uh, gel coat, to get this right here done. So this will be painted, I think tomorrow Hector's gonna come and we're gonna finish the painting of the 5500 gallon, which will be one of the videos coming up probably this week. It's Vlogmas, baby, so you see me every single day. Thank y'all so much for running chicken, running chicken, for watching today's video. If you haven't subscribed, make sure to subscribe down below because we are indeed posting every single day of the week, Monday through Friday. If you haven't became a member, I highly suggest checking that out. The link is right down below. These chickens are getting really, really people friendly. It is indeed Vlogmas, so I'll see you right back here tomorrow. Peace. Don't even think about it.